Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Windows 10 Update KB4023057 is rolling out again, and this is for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2, and 2004, and I received my update this morning on the 9th of September. Now, this is a regular update that Microsoft pushes out for Windows 10, and basically what the update does is it helps improve the Windows update process and applies reliability improvements on your device to get your PC ready for upcoming monthly and feature updates. Now, if we just head over to uh, Windows Update quickly, yeah, you can see the update 4023057. And just under a month ago, on the 13th of August, it was also installed on my machine. And if I go down a little bit more, you can see in June it was also installed and so on, yeah, in April as well. So it does get pushed out on a regular basis, as I have mentioned in previous videos. And that's just to get your PC ready for uh, the update process and also feature updates. Now, my personal opinion is that the reason this is getting pushed out so frequently now, because I've received two of these in the last month, um, is that Windows 10 version 21H2 is rolling out shortly, possibly in October, which is next month, or no later than November. So obviously Microsoft is getting machines ready for that feature update. Now, as I mentioned, this is for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2, and 2004, and it's a mandatory compulsory automatic update. So it will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your, onto your machine. And you cannot uninstall this update. It gets installed automatically and there is no uninstall uh, option for KB4023057. Now, if we just head back into our settings and apps and we look at our apps and features list, you will see if I scroll down to Microsoft Update Health Tools, it also updates the Microsoft Update Health Tools, which is also updated today on the 9th of September. And that's part of the update, uh, which is KB4023057. Uh, the Update Health Tools are part of that update. And every time that update rolls out, the Update Health Tools also get updated as well. Now, basically what the update will do if you have any of these issues on your machine, um, it may try to reset your network settings if it detects any problems and it may repair disabled or corrupted Windows operating system components if it detects problems there. It can even compress files in your user profile directly directory to help free up uh, disk space. So it will also try and free up disk space if uh, the updates um, detects that you haven't got enough uh, uh, disk space. Uh, for the next update or feature update. And it also may reset the Windows Update database to repair the problems that could prevent updates from installing successfully. So as I mentioned, KB4023057 uh, is rolling out again to get PCs ready for upcoming monthly and feature updates. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.